Hello, we're on page 100. We're going to be looking at the guided practice 2A through 2C here. We have R or P. So we have January 1st is the first day of New Year, or January is a fall month. Okay. January 1 is the first day of a new year. Or January is a fall month. So what we have here is R is true and P is false. So we have true or false since just one of the parts is true, this is true. Okay, in an or statement. You just need part of it to be true for the whole thing to be considered true. Now we have Q or not R. Okay, Q is January has only 30 days. Okay, so that part's false. Or not R, January 1 is the first day of the new year. So, Jan so it's not R. So January 1 is not. Not the first day. So here we have January has only 30 days, which is false, or January 1 is not the first day of a new year, which is also false. So false or false makes this compound statement false. Your next part here, we have P or not Q. So it's going to be January is a fall month. Or not Q, which means January does not have only 30 days. Okay, so what we have is January is a fall month, that is false, or January does not have only 30 days. That part is true. So we have false or true. Since one of them is true, the compound statement is true.